So on today's video, I'm going to be fitting a Noctua fan to the T300. Just to help it in hot weather and long races because they do suffer from fade. Once I open the base up, I'll show you why. So first off, let's take the base cover off. Now it's four screws here. Then behind that there should be three screws. Then also five screws under the base. One at the back and then another two at the side. So let's get that stripped off. So now we've got the case off. You can see the fan we're going to be replacing. And that's the fan we're going to be replacing it with. Much wider. So this is the problem, the power pack is encased in the wheel, which is a really poor design. So overheating is a big issue. So hopefully with a fan, a, well an upgrade on the fan, and I'm going to drill some vents either side of the case to help a bit of venting. So let's get this fan off. So once we got the fan off, then we disconnect it from the original bracket and then fit it to the new one. With this, I had to turn the screws round the other way in order for it to work. So you put the nut on the back like so. Make sure you get your direction of the fan flowing right. And then that just sits on there. Next off, we need to sort the wiring because this is a free pin and the original one is a two so we need to just cut into the wire join the wires and then sh heat shrink it and then we can put it back on so I'll get on with that now plugs joined up now um, just the red to red black to black and just tape the yellow one up and hide it in the loom and then it's ready to go back on. Fans on, just checking it's operational and then we can put the lid back on. So case back on now. I've drilled two holes either side for extra venting. You could put a bit of mesh at the back of that, you know, just to make it look good, but I've not bothered with that. I use the cone cutter, you could use a drill saw but cone cutter is fine just afterwards just neaten the edge up with a file, jobs are good. So all in all piece of piss of a job, I'd say the hardest part was the actual wire from the original fan, uh, the two pin plug when you're joining that onto the new fan, the original two pin plug, the wire is pretty shit and it's a little bit fiddly so you've got to be very careful. So yeah, there you go. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment and subscribe. Thank you.